a very warm welcome and thanks to all our distinguished dignitaries and esteemed guests for joining us for today's virtual infotech session while security continues as one of the topmost priority for the CIOs and CTOs strengthening remote work has emerged as one of the top priority now every company is a tech company on this backdrop, I would like to invite Dr. Deepak Kumar Sahu, Chief Editor of Air India, to kindly present his welcome address. Good afternoon, respected delegates from the industry and the corporate world, speakers, panelists, CIOs, and CTOs, and technical evangelists from various industry verticals, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for attending the 19th edition of Infotech Forum, and it gives me immense pleasure welcoming you all to this virtual forum and an opportunity to talk about accelerating business transformation strategy for your own organizations. First of all, I would like to thank the CIO Club for supporting this year's eminent CIOs of India session. We are thankful to the CEOs, CIOs, CTOs, CISOs for attending this virtual forum. Digital technologies have advanced more rapidly than any innovation in our history. Today, we are witnessing our flagship event annual infotech forum, not physically, but digitally. We have literally reached the digital age in advance. Today's entire session is centered on how to accelerate business transformation. I would say it is a strategic method of getting your organization from where you are now to where you will need to be in the future. The sudden need to accelerate digital customer solutions workforce productivity and collaboration tools and global supply chain transformation has reframed what is possible, reset expectation around what is needed and revealed the choke points in an environment where business need to continue to adapt to change. I am sure there will be various takeaways from this event. We have many quizzes and lucky draws during the session to make the forum more interactive. Technology has changed the way people are doing business, thinking, behaving, communicating, and working at different workplaces. At the same time, digitalization puts the consumer in the driver's seat, making them more informed, more demanding, and more vocal about what they want and what they do not want. It is like 3D graphics. It's like discover, design, and deliver. With the whole world gradually going back to normal and offices getting operational, the pursuit to complete projects took precedence over everything and the overall demand just went haywire. We cannot deny the fact that there is a demand fueled by the industry and the gap will take time to fill and will have interesting times. Now it is a gala time for the professionals who are well trained and qualified to bargain up to two to three times of the present salary. Indeed, a study finds that by 2030, there will be a global human talent shortage of more than 85 million people or roughly equivalent to the population of Germany. Organizations undertake business transformation to create additional value. This may be unlocking the potential of employees, harnessing intellectual property and proprietary technology for additional purposes or becoming more efficient to maximize the company's potential. Speaking on today's topic, accelerating your digital transformation strategy, it becomes imperative for all business, whether small, medium or large. However, I would say the COVID-19 crisis has accelerated the organization of consumer interactions by several years. Enterprises should be able to deliver customized applications at the speed of ideas. According to our survey with 500 CIOs in India, about 85% of organizations say their organization is already undergoing digital transformation. Secondly, India's fintech market is the world's fastest growing with 67% of the more than 2,100 fintech entities in operation have been set up in the last five years. Bengaluru and Mumbai are where most fintech companies have their India headquartered as they are the country's technology and furniture hubs. 
Indeed, innovation in fintech is driving the future of banks and financial systems. Fintech is creating a new window of possibility to drive transformation. Thank you so very much and be a part of all the wonderful sessions ahead. Namaste.